Coming to the ring at a combined weight of 400 pounds, Thomas O. Champ R. And Johnny Gargano, DIY. Ladies and gentlemen, we have tag team action coming up. And given the state of the tag team division right now and how incredibly competitive it is, this match might just make or break one of these teams. Top guy time! And their opponents, at a combined weight of 446 pounds, the Raw Tag Team Champions, Scott Dawson and Dash Wilder, The Revival! No nonsense, no gimmicks, no flips. Just fists. Two men who proudly carry collective chips on their shoulders, and they've managed to use that, that bitterness to bring themselves to the big stage where it's their time to shine. Rough and tough as they come. Old school throwbacks. Both legal men are in the ring and set to start oh, things off here. We're ready to go. Doesn't get any better than this. We're about to witness tag team action at its finest, fellas. Uh-oh. Neck breaker. Uh-oh. Oh, nasty impact. Rock kick right on point. Nailed it. This might be it. Oh, my. Brutal knee right to the face. Scott Dawson on the defensive here. Headed into this match, he and his partner look extremely confident. It's no secret that quick tags lead to success in the tag team division. And I'd say the quicker he can make that tag here, the better their chances of winning will be. This thing appears to be slipping away from him in a hurry, guys. And you can bet he envisioned things going much differently for him Ooh. heading into this match. Elbow drop with authority. Scott Dawson looks to be in some pretty bad trouble here. How can he get out of this mess? In a tag team contest, a superstar and partner lock up against another duo. Unless there's a special stipulation added to the match, the traditional rules of a singles match apply in terms of winning the match via pinfall, submission, countout, or disqualification. You gotta believe this one's over! In a standard tag team match, one competitor is in the ring against an opponent, and their teammate is in their corner standing on the ring apron. I should also point out that the competitor in the ring, as far as the referee is concerned, is the legal man. Only the legal man can attempt to score a fall over an opponent or be defeated by an opponent. In a tag match, when a superstar tags their partner, the person who tagged out has until the referee's count of five to exit the ring. For a tag to be considered legal, both of the superstar's feet have to be on the apron. The partner must be touching the tag rope in the corner both team members must touch, and the referee must see the tag be made. Oh! Ooh-wee! For many years, members of the WWE Universe and the WWE Locker Room have felt that tag team matches should have two referees. One referee is in the ring overseeing the action, and the other is located out on the floor, making sure teams follow the rule. Tag. They're setting him up. Kick. It's not Scott Dawson's night, guys. It's just not. Byron, earlier you raised a point that people have been talking about for years, and that's a second referee being appointed to tag team matches. I remember he's got him covered. Two, three, three. They did it! They 
won the match. These guys were awesome. Let's take another look. These guys showed flashes in this match, but flashes don't exactly set the world on fire, as these highlights show very well. And here's the last piece of the puzzle. Here are your winners, Thomas O. Champ R. And Johnny Gargano, DIY. You heard the ring announcer. This one's over. And here's your winner. I knew these two were a great team. I just didn't know how great. Wow. They really impressed me out here. Folks, if you're just tuning in, you just missed one of the greatest tag team matches I've seen in years.